Hey guys, back at you again here at Ben's Auto Repair. Um, today we got a 2006 Honda Odyssey. It got towed into the shop yesterday, and um, it won't move. So we're gonna take this transmission out. We're gonna rebuild it. Um, I'm gonna have a tail down video and a rebuild video coming. Um, a lot of y'all been asking about a rebuild video, so I want to show you a rebuild video. Um, this, this Odyssey has 261,000 miles on it. See, look, every customer I get, they don't got no gas in them hardly, never. So I'm gonna put gas in it. This thing's been sitting for three years, to be honest with you. Um, they've been trying to find somebody to rebuild this time mission. Everybody's been telling them about $3,000. So this Odyssey's okay, but I've seen worse. But anyways, I got my stand tool right right here. And we can show it shows me the shift solenoids and everything. So everything right now everything's off because I got it in park. When I put it in reverse right here, actually the shift B is on because it's sitting there in park. But I put it in reverse. See, you got on right there for shift solenoid C is on. So the shift the shift solenoids are working the way they're supposed to. I put down the drive right here. And there you go. So you got A on, B on, and C on. The CC solenoid valve is off like it's supposed to be. Now, take my foot off the brake and I give it gas. Not moving at all. Now, if you hear that, sorry about that. Mm. If you hear that squealing noise on these Honda Odysseys and love the 2004 and up V6 Accords, you got a little filter inside the cooling line. A cooling line filter, they clog a lot. When they clog up, that's where you get that squealing. And usually you'll lose third gear. But this one won't move at all. So the filter, more than likely the filter and the cooling line filter is clogged. But with I put my bus right here, it tries to back up. See what it does. Barely grabs. So it, she barely grabs in reverse. Anyways, what was I saying? On these Honda Odysseys, the most common problem that goes wrong with them is third gear. Third gear drum, they go out, they weld together. It's trying to go in two gears at one time. The number one killer is the torque converter. So when we get the when we get the parts in, we're gonna put a brand new torque converter on this thing, everything. So once again, it's a 2006 Honda Odyssey. We don't got no codes in it whatsoever. So we ain't, it ain't throwing no codes. Only time you'll get a code in it is for like an incorrect gear ratio because it's going in two gears at one time. Um, the bat, Unfortunately, the battery was dead when I got it. So I can't pull no codes from it. But I can see on my scan tool, the SIF solenoids are working the way they're supposed to. Let's see here. Look at one more thing. One second, let's see here. One more thing real fast. See, we go right there. Back around. So, we got automatic transmission with bus switch. It's on. So, right here, I put it in neutral. Neutral is the next one down. There's neutral. There's drive. We got off all the way. Forward switch is on. So it is trying to engage. And then you got your automatic transmission D switch is on like it's supposed to be. D3, 
We got a little button on the side right here that's off. So everything sensor-wise is working on this thing the way it posts to. So, um, so basically, yeah, here's downshift request. This basically everything. I think my scan shows me everything. It shows me what gear you in. See your gear ratio. See here it shows. Okay. So right here it shows when first gear shift control that's from the computer and first gear when you go down the road it should go first second all the way to fifth. So I go to reverse, save and reverse, drive, see here, first. Second, and it goes back to first start there because I'm in D. Hit this button right here, and ain't gonna do it. Sometimes I have to do it, anyways. Um, see, I don't know why my scan tool keeps doing this every time I close that and go back, it keeps changing my thing around. Let's see here. Here we go. So, engine's at 185 degrees. You come down here. The temperature, the transmission temperature is at 87 degrees. But it won't fucking, it won't not move, so. Excuse my language. But yeah, I'll try one more time. Get my phone to focus. Oh, it tried to grab right there. But it will not grab all the way. So, Anyways, stay on the lookout. This is a 2006 Honda Odyssey. We This has the five speed transmission in it. And I believe this one is the BGRA. Won't know for sure until I get it out. But um, if it's not the BGRA, it will be the BAYA. So uh, stay tuned and we'll have two long videos coming up soon. Uh, on the tail down video, it won't be much talking. It'll basically, I'll be basically be pointing out the problems and everything. And on the rebuilt video, it probably won't be no talking at all. Just please watch and hope y'all like it. Thanks again. Here at Ben's Auto Repair.